So this vlog is from last October but I wanted to kick off the new year with it because I am back on YouTube and I also wanted to shout out Valerie, the niche sampler. You absolutely need to follow her because she's an amazing content creator but also a dear friend that really knows her stuff when it's about perfume. Enjoy! Guys, so we're in Geneva. I'm with a great content creator that does perfume. I'm sorry, I almost forgot my eyes out. <laughs> Please tell us your TikTok name before Hi, I'm I watch it. Hi, Valerie, aka the niche sampler on TikTok and Instagram. And I talk about niche perfumes and other luxury fragrances. A lot of fragrances I don't even know about, heard about. And um, I will link her profile in my bio, no, in my caption box, so you can follow her. And we're like off to the first fragrance store to try fragrances. Not trying to buy anything. We're just keeping our nose updated. Yes, and we let you know what things we like. Yeah. So at Guerlain, they had this technology that I've not seen before. It was interactive where a computer would figure out what kind of fragrances of Guerlain would be the most matching to you. And I also seen that they had a bottle up at Guerlain that was around $10,000. And I thought that was crazy and was just wondering who might buy this bottle and what was in it but I forgot to ask but here you can see how it works so the computer tells you to basically try out different numbers and then it will figure out which ones you like. Yeah. This, is like this is very vegetal. I really like it. <laughs> Did you ever press like I really really like? Yes. Oh, okay. the 51. oh so, so let's see like what choice Valerie gets. Preferred perfume mode. Oh, I'm curious. Ah, woodsy. Or woodsy. Chipre, yeah. à mon avis. Oriental wood chip. That makes sense. Et parfum. Alors, l'art et la manière. Spiritueuse, double vanille, cherry wood, and aqua legoria, neroli abetua. Vous voulez sentir les parfums Oui, qu'on a choisi pour vous. Euh, je veux dire qu'on est sur les de mini, j'aime ça beaucoup. Euh, et Cherry Wood, I love that one as well. Ah, alors ça va faire. Et c'est Nina, c'est Nina, c'est que vous avez choisi. Dans le... But this one, it's really muted. It's more about the words, right? Oh, this is nice as well. Yeah, me too. I think I'm still shopping for the perfect oud for my collection, and oud, nude, and cherry oud are like high on the list. So we're trying. Sorry, the light is really bad. Are we trying Angelique Noir? That's really hyped up. Honestly, not my kind of. I think it's overhyped personally. It's a it's a nice, it's nice but it's not like it's not groundbreaking. Let's try spiritual vanilla. This reminds me of uh, Tiota. It's very vanillic. Um, I think it's very similar to. It reminds me of like vanilla tequila by Paris Monte Carlo. Mm -hmm. There's like the bitter aspect of it. Yeah. But very the cherry vanilla. wood. Oh my goodness. That's the one. I would like something like <gasps> with um, this is the one. Sorry. Your baluga. I would like it's something different. with amber. I think you like that one. Ah, oh, that's nice. It's like there's powdery. Yeah, this is a bit really Oh, that's nice. A lot of people like the musk of this collection, but I forget his name. Oh. I will musk try a cherry wood on my skin. But now when you add it, the thing is, like you can try fragrance, but when you add it in skin, it's so different. Oh yeah, because now I realize it's got lots of cardamom. <laughs> I just want my one. style. Oud nude. Can you remember? Oud mood is on my Oud nude is on my right. Okay. No, but this is oh my god, this is gorgeous. Like the Oud ch cherry Oud. The two. This is Oud nude. No, this is Oud oh, cherry Oud. Yeah. Right. Wow, it's right? beautiful. It's really beautiful. I think it's. Um, normally, by the way, oh, okay, in some stores they have the notes at the bottom of the bottle, but not here. Maybe in the. No, it's not. Well, 
Valerie trying Babylon by Pin Halligans. Yeah. Love it deep, rich, the vanilla. I love about the fragrance really is how nice. it develops afterwards. After lunch, we decided to go to the Maison Cire boutique, and I'm so I was so excited to show Valerie because she didn't have a chance yet to smell Maison Cire, and I also I'm obsessed with their candles. The brand is just amazing. You know, I really really love the brand. Fragrance fan in general, and you love everything that smells nice, especially for your home. I would definitely recommend Maison Cire because their candles are one of the best, and believe me, I try a lot. Um, I think the quality is amazing and they make your home smell so nice. My favorite is Vent du Désert. I fell in love with the candle. She got something. What candle did you get? I got Palissandre des Andes. What does it smell like? It smells like luxury. That's all I can say. It's a little witty, a little spicy, a little creamy, refined. It's just going to give me a zen interior. Like I love luxurious smelling fragrances. Yes. And I smell perfect oud. Wow. Oh wow, it's transformed. Yeah, it's beautiful. Oh my god. I'm going to wear my sun. I'm wearing my sunglasses because honestly, the end of the day and I'm cold. But we have a debate. What's your favorite chip flavor? Crisps. Yeah, crisps. Crisps, sorry, chips. Salt and vinegar. Oh yeah, I agree. Salt and vinegar and truffle. Truffle, yes. If you could do a fragrance flavor, what would it be? Because we just saw like chips with honey and butter. No, saffron. Saffron. Vanilla. I need caramel. I need saffron. I need sandalwood. Maybe some tonka as well. What else? Some cypriol. I love that. that. Very good fragrance. What about you? Saffron, amber, sandalwood. I don't want to say because then the competition is going to. The competition is on the phone. <laughs> We ended our lovely day with a tea time at the Four Seasons. I hope you enjoyed this vlog and I see you next time.